the Mustang Morning News. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Mustangs! Today is Wednesday, January 31st. I'm Colin. And I'm Nicholas. And, and we'll, we'll be your host, host for today. today. During both lunches, Pride Pack will meet in room 33. Happy early birthday to Mr. Plum. His birthday is on the 3rd. Tomorrow at 4 p.m., Wrestling Club will meet to see Encina High School versus Star King and Katherine Johnson. May the best wrestler win! Speaking of those who are the best, outstanding students will be getting pizza, soda, cookies, and root beer floats on the last Friday. Hi there, I'm Mr. Taylor. I'm here with a sixth grade lunch bunch. We're honoring a bunch of our students today in order of excellent academic and effort, honoring them in increased participation. Basically, what we do here at Lunch Bunch is we pick the students that we want to recognize for their effort and their academic performance, even if they're just climbing up. We're rewarding them for constantly moving forward and always looking ahead. All right, these students have been invited to our lunch bunch this time for a number of different reasons. Mr. Jackson and myself appreciated the students that grew a lot in their iReady diagnostics and so that's how we decided our uh, students but other teachers chose them for different reasons but they all chose them for being good role models to other students and doing what they're supposed to. My favorite thing about lunch bunch is I get to hang out with my friends. It's the food. Um, my Thing, my favorite thing about Lunch Brunch is hanging out with my friends and teachers. The thing about Lunch Brunch is the fact that I get to eat tons of pizza and cookies. Have you been wondering how all those school dances have been prepared? Come look at a behind the scenes video of how the student government prepares these events. Today we're going to show you how student government prepares for the dance. Student government prepares for the dance by first getting a list of the type of decorations that we want to match our theme. Um, it's really fun to vote and pick our theme and then from there we put in the order for the decorations. Then we talk about, well, what do we want it to look like? What is the schematic? And just making sure we're planning a fun event that has a little something for everyone. In student government, there's a lot of steps we have to take to plan a dance, such as decorations, the DJ, publicity and posters, ticket sales, and other things that all go into preparing for the dance. Now let's see why student government decided to have their dance. We want to make sure that you guys have a well-rounded uh, type of event experience here. So not just field day, not just rallies, but another opportunity for you to express yourselves and just let loose and have a good time. I think one of the reasons students student government hosts the dance is because it's a way to reward the students and have fun outside of school. A lot of preparation goes into making a beautiful dance. Wow, I never knew how much student government had to go through for each dance. Now it's time it's for shout outs. Shout outs. This show that goes to Sadie Hodge, grade 6, for by Miss Barry for being kind. Sadie helped decorate one of our bulletin boards and was a great help in class. Thank you, Sadie, for being so kind and helpful in the classroom. This show that goes to Miss Holtai, staff member referred by Haley for being kind. 
She is the sweetest, kindest teacher. She always makes sure everyone is okay. I always want her around. She is the best person. Thank you, Ms. Holtai. This should have goes to Ms. Foster, great staff member referred by Brooke for being kind. Ms. Foster is a great teacher. She always makes sure we get our work done and is phenomenal at keeping her cool. Like when her classes are misbehaving and not listening, I find it fascinating how she does it. She is a good teacher. The shout out goes to DJ Stern, grade 6, referred by Miss Barry for being kind. DJ was an awesome help in decorating our bulletin boards and organizing our clay. Thank you, DJ, for being so kind and helpful in our classroom. Today is also the day to spin the shout out wheel of names. If you are picked from the wheel, you get two gift cards for free cheeseburgers at In and Out. Person's lucky. Anyways, that's it for today's Mustang Morning News. I'm Nicholas. And I'm Colin. Signing, Signing off. off.